so this is a direct response to the video that you just posted. Well, I don't know if you just posted it, but it doesn't say when you posted it. But the one that you posted today um, about, like, superficiality. Here's the thing. I, maybe I have a disorder or something. I don't know. I am not a superficial person. Like, if someone's hot. Okay, here's the thing. Like, for me, someone, what makes someone beautiful to me is, like, who they are as a person, not what they look like. So, like, for the most part, I would hold judgments about people's appearances because, before I get to know them, because I really don't have judgments about their appearances before I get to know them. If that, that doesn't really make any sense. So, like, okay. Oh, man. I just don't know how to describe it. So, like, what makes a person, ev like, every, I know that this is how not, this is, like, most people aren't like this, but for me, 100% of what makes a person attractive is who they are. And, like, who they are if, if who they are is beautiful, it shines through so that I, I can appreciate their outer appearance. Like, regardless of what an objective third-party observer would say. Like, I've always... The guys that I've, that I've really... That I've dated, that I've been in, in real relationships with, um, my friends have always been like why do you like him? He's not he's not cute. And I'm just like, I don't see it. Because these have been great guys. Interesting guys, you know. Smart and, and funny and, you know, unique and passionate and dedicated and, and just really great people. And um, I've never seen how they look. And that's really why I think, for me, like, when it comes to being in a relationship with someone... Um, it's never been about gender for me. I don't like to describe myself as bisexual because I don't like that category. I don't think that that adequately describes me. It's not that I'm attracted to both genders physically, but that because all I really care about is who a person is, it doesn't matter what they look like on the outside, and that includes, like, whether they have a dick or, like, a vagina, okay? I don't really care. That That's irrelevant to me that's always been irrelevant to me a relationship that I want to have has always been founded on um you know being able to have intellectual conversations with this person being able to read books with this person and watch movies and and play video games and, and it's never been about I mean the sex is important but it's never been about that for me so, I don't know. I'm just weird or something, I guess. But I, I can't describe it. I really, I've tried to do, I've tried to describe it before. It just doesn't work. I, I really don't find people attractive unless I think that they have a good personality. Um, that's just how it is. Um, as for Rob, I disagree with you because... There's one thing if you appreciate the way people look physically. It's another if you're a complete superficial whore <laughs> like him. I'm not even kidding. It's You can't go around just saying like, oh, that girl's hot. That girl's hot. Like, 17 girls are hot. Like, get over yourself. Seriously? Like, I don't walk down the street and be like, oh, that guy's hot. That guy's hot. That guy's hot. Like, no. That's not hormonal, okay? That's just, like, insane, superficial boy behavior, all right? Like, I have hormones, but I don't go around thinking everybody I meet is hot, nor do I really, like, want to get to know someone just because they're hot. Like, for example, Justin. Justin came up to me and started talking to me. We had never met. We weren't in any classes together. We don't even go to the same school. I mean, he goes to the community college, and I don't. And he just comes up and starts talking to me. Why? Because he thinks I'm hot, okay? 
and he wants to go out. So I agree to that. Does it work out? No, because we have completely different personalities. You shouldn't even, like, go out with someone unless you know something about them. Like, saying, oh, they're hot, so that's why I want to get to know more about them, that's bullshit, okay? That is a complete and utter lie. Like, you should get to know someone, and then you can, like, date them. But you shouldn't just go after someone you think is hot, like, on virtue of their being hot. And, and pray that they're going to be an interesting and good person. Because that's stupid. Because, I mean, it, it's just ridiculous to me. It's just a ridiculous concept. People that are that way, I think, are ridiculous. I think that they're, like, one of the reasons that I hate myself so much. Um, and I just think it's really, really stupid. The people that I've dated in the past have been people who I've been friends with for, like, ever, basically. And people who I've always loved as friends and appreciated as friends and have known a lot about. Like, with Chris, like, okay, we're not dating, but, hmm, we will be. Just kidding. I mean, no, I'm not kidding, but, um, like, the thing about Chris is, like, it doesn't matter to me what he looks like. Like, he could look like an alien. I just thought about the doctor. Sorry. Um, like, a creepy alien. Like, what's a creepy? Like, a Klingon. Okay? And I wouldn't care because who he is as a person matters more to me. And that's what makes him a beautiful person. It has nothing to do with what he looks like. It never will. It never has. And we were friends first. You know what I mean? I don't know. It's always been more about personality to me. It's just, it's always been about personality. It's never been about how someone looks and people that are superficial suck and I hate them and that's it superficiality and judgmental people they both suck and yeah I'm being judgmental against judgmental people I realize that's an oxymoron but I don't care I just cannot stand people that are superficial because looks are not everything okay looks are determined by genetics who you are is somewhat determined by genetics and you know environment whatever but a lot of who you are and how you treat people is your own decision. And that is the only thing that you should be judged on. The only thing. That's the only thing that matters. Appearance doesn't matter because you can't really help your appearance. I mean, just the way it is. And, you know, I just think it's sick and I think it's wrong. And I don't, I don't like Rob. I'm sorry, I don't. I don't like people that are like that. I don't like people who go around... Just saying, oh, that girl's hot. That's why I want to get to know her, because she's hot. Like, okay, maybe, like, you know, you'll get to know her and you'll find out that she's a great person, but you shouldn't go after her because she's hot. I don't care about hormones. That's bullshit, okay? I have hormones, and I don't do that. All right? Like, it's just stupid. It's just stupid, and it blows my mind, the stupidity of it. And... I just hate it. I don't agree with superficiality. It's one of the things that irritates me most about the human race is superficiality. I really, really abhor it. I think it's sick and wrong. And, um, you know, you cannot judge a person by how they look on the outside. You just can't. Period. End of story. That's all there is to it. Like, it's ridiculous. It just, it's stupid. It's just stupid. That, that was an angry ranting video, you know, but I feel very strongly about superficiality because um, people judge me all the time based on how I look and I don't judge anyone based on how they look. So it's like, it bothers me. Yeah, it bothers me a lot. So that's my ranting video. Yeah. Anyway, that's it.